morning. Back in the garage. Uh, we got a little lawn tractor project here. This lawn tractor belonged to my sister. Uh, she wants it back, but she wants it fixed. So here's what we've got. We've got, if you can see behind me here, we've got a Troy built uh, lawn tractor. Let's take a look at it right now. All right, so it's a Troy built tractor. It's the uh, seven speed pony. So let's open up the hood. Here's what the problem is. If you look down in here, and I popped this cover out already, all right? Easy to pop up and in. Uh, you can see where take that bolt loose. We've got this plastic part here. Uh, and we've got, if you look down in there real good, where's my flywheel? Where's my, where's, where is it? Well, there's chunks. If you see a chunk, see a chunk over here. So what happened is that thing broke and uh, rattles the motor like crazy. So she said, hey, there's a problem with my tractor. So we went out and we looked online for a kit. And we found this kit right here. That's your uh, Genuine uh, Briggs & Stratton equipment. So we're going to show you how to put that on. Let's go through the tools and get started. Here's all we think we need right now. 10 millimeter wrench, 10 millimeter socket, because we've got some bolts to get at. We'll show you those. And we've got a uh, 15, 16 socket on an impact driver. That's to get that off. If you don't have an impact, you're going to have to put a pipe wrench way under here to hold that shaft. So we're going to take out these screws, this one, this one, and the two that are up front right there. All right, to get started, you take your air cleaner off, pop off the cover. That's a dirty air filter we got there, but this pops out, all right? It's going to have to pop out to uh, get this piece to lift off. Again, up front, you can use a socket wrench. Quite long. It's got a little washer on it. Don't lose that little washer. It's uh, somewhat melted on this one. Uh, that's what's going to happen if you run this motor too hot. Going to start to melt plastic. If this thing is broke, that's what's going to happen. But I was able to get the bolt out without it. Again, was able to get it out. Should be able to lift this off. All right, looks like there's a screw right here. You got to have a blade screwdriver to get that screw up. Lose a screw. Off. Real easy. Hey, look, see, this is the part that broke. All right. You can see there are two halves to this part. See, it's pretty much all still there. That's the garbage part. It's in our kit. The kit comes with several parts. Comes with a new flywheel. Comes with a new top. My guess is this plastic top moves, allows this to shear loose. So they gave you a new one of these. They also give you a new cover. So what we're going to do. 
air compressor on. Like I say, if you don't have an impact, you're going to have to uh, deal with the other. So we're just going to break this loose. Actually, it came loose pretty easy. Fifteen sixteenths. That piece comes up. This comes off. This is the piece that was goes on. You can feel it. See the two dimples here. That goes right there. We'll clean out some of this plastic while we're here. All right. Uh, this is all plastic. This is metal. We're going to use the metal one because that's what they gave us. We think the plastic one is why they fail. So this just goes on here like this. Looks like uh, looks like you got to get this piece off. This piece here doesn't belong on there. So if this piece of metal stays on there, you got to pry it off. Boom. Now you can put this back on. See that locks in real nice. Now you can put this up here. That looks like that's going to work pretty well. It's got a little bit of a gap in there, but that's probably all right. That's probably to push down on that. Turn the air compressor on. Huh? Alright, little air helps. And you can look under here, see that that's tight all the way. Alright, so that's on, that's tight. Some of the plastic debris out of here. Let's get a wire brush. Clean up some of these vents and fins a little bit here. All in there. Get some of this stuff off the carburetor. Alright, now we gotta put the top back on. This part here we took off flexible this throwaway recycling bin. Now we gotta put this cover back on. Covers clean underneath. A couple spots where that was popped off. I'm going to put this back on. Make sure this metal shield is tucked in like it should be. Then go around the other side. To get it tucked in properly. Turn your cover back on. Quarter turn. Put the top back on. You can either use the one they gave you or you can use the old one if you like the name. So, at this point, back together. Like and subscribe, post notifications on. We just fixed our flywheel problem, our cracked in half plastic part on our Briggs & Stratton 15.5 horsepower Troy built lawn dragger. Easy to do. Do it yourself. Save the money. Heck, it probably cost 50 bucks. Just to have them come out and haul this into the dealer. So, there you go. Like and subscribe, post notifications on. I'm going to show you a sneaky way to change oil next.